Hi folks, but Mikey Bly here and finally, oh finally, we are back with some more, don't give up, cynical tale, I played the demo for this, quite a ways, 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 ways ago, a long time ago, it's been a while since I played the demo of this and I loved it so much, I backed it on Kickstarter and it succeeded and it has been created and the full version is finally out. And I'm super happy. Uh, so I have got us. I've got us right back to where I was at the end of the demo. Um, and if you haven't seen my playthrough of this yet, then somewhere it will have popped up. There will be a clickable thing to go and check it out. So click, check out the beginning, and then come right back here. Report in when you're ready, present, and correct to carry on the story. I'll give you the quick roundup. Very quick. We played Triss who is a down and out wannabe video game developer. <clears throat> yeah, might be semi-autobiographical. Uh, but we also have some cool fighting skills that we kick people's ass, only when they deserve it though. There's also a couple of shadowy people who are after us for some bizarre reason, I don't really know why, but it might have something to do with the legendary sword that we seem to have when we're in battle. And that's pretty much everything I can tell you, other than that we're on our way to a party, but we're late for a party because we spent some time hanging around with the new girl that went to our apartment building. Oopsie. Um, so our friend invited us, trying to make us be social, right? He's like, you're fine, I guess I'll go and bloody party. Jeez, it's so hard. Um, and that catches you up. But you'd be much better off checking out the demo playthrough, to be honest, because my little roundup was crap. All right, anyway, it's like an action RPG game with lots of goofy goofy comedy in it. Yes, right up my alley. Anyway, as I mentioned, we're late. I say we, Triss, you're late. You're late. Not like I care, but well, well, that's fine then, I guess. Being late means I'll have to socialize less. Ah, I like it. It's good thinking right there, good thinking. God. Why am I even here? Because you're a good friend. Who listens to your friends? <sighs> uh, okay, so, Birdie's telling me I've got to do list. Party time! Oh, fine, for the love of God, I guess. Which, which way I go this way? Oh, yeah, this looks like the way. Hey, uh, are you here? I'm on my way. Should be there in about 30 minutes. Wait, hang on. She's not even at the party yet? What? Beck! I know, I know. I'm sorry. You'll be fine. Socialize. You know, you act super grumpy, but I know you always have a good time once you actually decide to give it an effort. Break the ice and I'll come rescue you before you know it. Oh, this is making me feel really anxious. Did you just actually say grumble grumble? I actually said grumble grumble. Yes. That's why we're friends. See you soon. Could you do this to me? Why? Is there anything else I can do? Let's just leave. Let's just leave. Screw it. Let's go. Uh, back to the train station. Go. No. God damn it. Fine. Um. Oh. Oh. All right. I'm here. Gonna be fine. I got a thousand bucks from one of the bad guys, actually. We don't know he's a bad guy. Yeah, he bumped into us and made us drop a pizza. But then he gave us a grand. Like, oh, yeah, cool. So we've got money. Not that we, it's a party, so we probably don't need money. But anyway, find someone cute to talk to, avoid the socially awkward stragglers, and you'll get through this. It's supposed to be an open bar. I need to start drinking as soon as possible if I'm gonna survive. Oh, God, Triss, me and you, peas in a pod. Socially awkward bros. Alright, um, oh, the to-do list probably just says find a drink. Yep, okay, I can do this. Are we gonna, we probably shouldn't even attempt to talk to anybody yet, huh? Got any seed? Ew, no. You just asked like that? Did you have seed or did you not have seed? Because Rodney gets to get his, got to get his fix. No seed. Then Rodney has to wonder why he was talking to Rodney at this point in time. Um, I is going to leave Rodney alone now? Spliff-tastic. Coolest guy here, hands down. Definitely. 
Good. Glad that I agree with we agree with each other for a change. Brain. Oh my god. Can we? We probably don't want to even. Oh, oh, Dwayne. Don't tell me you want to know who my barber is. Uh, my crown was just as jacked up as yours once upon a time, bro. There's also a frequent joke about my receding hairline. It's not receding. I've got a luscious, lovely, full head of hair. It's just short at the moment, that's all. Tell you what, I'll give you Pablo's number if you pay me a finder's fee. He has a point. Your hair is pretty jacked up. We don't even want a brush. Can you ever back me up? Hey man, if you want to show to a party with a jacked up cut, it's less competition for me. If you change your mind, let me know. Yeah, screw you, Dwayne. Can I talk to any of Rodney's friends? Oh, I can't. Warren. In my personal space, bruh! Don't even know you like that! Fair. I was like right up in his face, right up in his grill. Randy? Great party, huh, bruh? Name's Randy. I'm gonna get smashed to oblivion! How many have you had so far? Uh, lost count, bro. Too busy focusing on intake to worry about the cups of yester minute. Yeah, chug a log, chug a log, chug a log, chug, chug. Glurp is not a very attractive sound. Randy's beer went down the wrong tube. Oh god, no, was he dying? Randy is having a coughing fit. Uh, <laughs> Randy, let's walk away before anyone wants us. It's fine, one less body at the party. I mean, one more body, one less distraction. Ah, uh, uh, don't want to learn my ABCs, Snuffy. Oh look, he's alive. Pity. Chase the stars, Randy. Ugh. Oh, hi. Jessica, not interested. You know, that's not very nice. I don't care. I'm beautiful. I don't have to care. You know, I want to make a famous game one day. And when I do, I'll make sure there's a party where I can dunk you in the punch. Please tell me that's this game. Laugh it up while you can. Oh my. Can we actually talk to everybody here? No, okay. Hey, Julio. Listen, man. I'm not proud of what I do, but he signs my checks, okay? Oh, does he? Hey, yo, yo, yo! What's up, dog? No, don't. No, don't. No, don't. This is, this is, this is bad. What's the appropriate response in this situation? Hi seems a bit off for this one. Not a talker, eh? Well, that's perfect, because you can listen to our new record. Suburban struggle. Suburban what now? See, that's the mind state we're trying to dissolve in the game. People don't know how hard it is to grow up having your parents all up in your face like, Be a doctor, Corey! Man, squash that noise! Are you squashing, buddy? You go squash it good. I never looked at it like that. Mostly because you're insane. So will you buy my mixtape and support hip hop music? Uh, if it even touches me, I will call the police. <laughs> yes. Your loss. We about to change a cul-de-sac game forever. Now I'm saying, plenty of people want to own this piece of history. Mm, yeah. How many people have bought a record tonight? Zero? That's what I thought. At least he was honest, he could have easily lied. So I guess we can talk to everybody, you just have to... Nope, she really doesn't want to talk, so maybe she's, she's a no. Is he... Is that like Haki Sack? Talk to her? No, talk to this person, Adam. Oh, it's Pokeballs! Oh God! Don't get that theme juice stuck in my head, you jerk! The nostalgia. It burns! It's a good burn, kind of. I wanna be the very best. No one ever was. Oh no, don't! Don't keep going! To catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. To make them paint, destroy each other under the guise of love and friendship and exploit them for my... The multi-million dollar franchises is my selfish, self-invested purpose. <laughs> Good rewrite. I like it. <laughs> that got dark quick. Our childhoods were a lie. 
Oh, they weren't sharp. Leave Pokemon alone. <laughs> oh my. Now that's a hairstyle right there. Oh my god. What do you think of my outfit? You look like Cotton Candy. If Cotton Candy was a human that was desperate for attention. Um, I don't know. You know, let's, 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 let's keep this conversation going. Let's ask if that's a heart. Wow, you got it. Go start for you, you scholar, you. Well, if you don't mind, I'm more of a yellow smiley face sticker kind of guy. Keep it kind of on the down low, you know. Funny too. Whoa, then this body won't be so terrible. So tell me. Sorry, can you excuse me? I need to make myself available for one of these hunks and they might think you're my boyfriend if you continue standing next to me. and tribulations of being a bloody lanky nobody. Yeah, forget what I said. This is definitely terrible. Hey, uh, you're cute. Wow, mm, beating on the bush, huh? Whoa, do you always just walk up to girls like this? Only the ones worse with the daggers of shame. You're a quick one, but I have a boyfriend. Well, we're gonna keep this train moving. Swing and a miss. He's singing. And knocking the mic pretty hard to be honest. But does he know any other songs? Oh yeah, there's always one. This guy's jamming pretty hard. If he isn't careful, some innocent passerby could be on the wrong side of a concussion. Like me? Bish! Oh, there's of course there's people in the pool. Whereas there's the bar. There is a lot of people to talk to here. Oh my god, this is a lot. Can't talk to anybody in the pool, thankfully. Who are you, Jack? Hey Jackie, I really enjoyed that great view of the party we had. Yeah, it was great, Jack and Jackie. So unfortunately it was obstructed by the dude with the funky hair. Funky and lumpy. Lumpy and clumpy. Lanky and Jackie. Okay, I know, I get it. I can take a hint, I'll leave now. Janky and skanky. Skanky and... Manky? Manky. Oh, you win again, Jack. I realise you guys were insulting me at first, but I'm super not sure what's going on at this point. So I'm gonna go. Hi, Pinky. This girl is clearly doing her best not to acknowledge my existence. She's perfect for me. Careful there, bub. I'm falling off too easily now. Unfortunately, this also simultaneously destroys any chance of us being a thing, ever. Oh, look at this guy with his cool shades. Hubert. Let's go, Whippersnapper! How old are you? Do you just call me... Whippersnapper? Oh, the Millennials! Too cool to be called Whippersnappers now! No, I, I don't know. I'm not insulting. I quite like that word. It's pretty cool. I don't know the connotations behind it, but I quite like it. It's, it's, it's one of those nice words. So the old fangled. You just wait. I've been going on with two girls on my arm and at least twice as many numbers in the pocket. Numbers? Oh, you mean girls' numbers. Okay, alright. You do realise you're like 40, right? Don't wound me by making fun of 40-year-olds. I mean, I'm not 40, but I mean, I'm... I'm, I'm no. Gentleman never reveals his image. Needless to say, I'm not 40, but... Seeing 40-year-olds get made fun of is starting to make me panicky. So you try and figure out my age from there. <laughs> Shows what you know. I'm 41. Oh, okay. Cool. My mistake. When you're creepier than I originally thought. You're coming for my style, Sprat. Go pester someone else before I get mean. Can we fight this guy? Do we want to fight this guy? Why do we want to fight this guy? What good is that going to do us at the party? Fine. The clothes make me cry anyway. It's called douche repellent. The ladies love it because it keeps them safe with me and away from guys like you. Yeah, well, except you'd actually beat a girl for that to ever be true. If you've got the senior centre on your knees, I'm sure at least one of them will feel sorry for you. Ah, I can't hear you, can't hear you. If my midlife crisis ends up looking anything like this, just kill me now. Hey, cool people at the table. I, I see a funky moustache there. Smoker. Don't even, they don't even deserve names, I guess. I went on a blind date yesterday. Can you believe she refused to pay? Oh, fucking hell, get me out of this conversation already. I mean, she said she was a feminist, so I decided to let her see how it felt to be expected to pay the bill. 
Oh god. I'm not touching that conversation with a 10 foot pole. I don't blame you. Good call. <coughs> you never know who might be watching us. Dear me. Have I seen you somewhere? Absolutely not. Wait a minute. There was a show in the 90s about four babies and Chucky. It's Chucky. I thought that's who they were getting. I cannot even attempt to do a Chucky voice. It's 2017 for crying out loud. Just let me live my life. I was a baby for crying out loud. My parents pipped me into child acting before I could even finish my ABCs. I'm oh, sorry, Chuck. Didn't know you wanted it so hard. This conversation is not over yet. So can I have your autograph? Uh, we better go. Looks like he's about to blow a gasket. <laughs> hey, punch. No punch. No, no nibbles. Oh look, I found me! <laughs> this is definitely me right here. Oh, Johnny, it's not me. I recommend the nachos. The block is pretty good. Definitely not me, no, I'm not a nacho fan. Don't sue me. I'm allowed to not like things. Thanks, but I can't afford to get any chip pieces in my teeth until I completely strike out with everyone here. So give it a little bit more time. Hey, doodles. So, who are you guys? We're video game investors. Oh, I wonder if these are some of the people who back the Kickstarter. You, you mean like you give people money to make games? <gasps> Wait a minute, I smell a plot point brewing. Yep, that's amazing. I make games. Are you that Ian? He makes games. Yeah, him and every other millennial that knows a bit of C code. Remind me to email you a high five for that later. We're actually in the market for a new venture. What's your idea? Well, I have this revolutionary idea about a game. About a game dev. It'll be a, a pass. Yeah, that idea is terrible. Whew. It'll never sell. Yeah, well, you guys are old. Yes, we are. Old and rich, that is. Ha! You win this round, old timers. Man, I've been put out by three old people at this party. Uh -huh. Um, does this person have a face? Is this actually a, is this actually a really, really, really extravagantly disguised bush? Fine then. Brody? Oh god. Can't talk now. I'm on the clock. On the clock? You mean you're working? You get paid to go to parties? Seat filler? Isn't it obvious? Look at these guns! Security man. Oh, security, okay. Why is that easy keeping secure with that physique? The snack table? <laughs> oh, zing. Um, can't talk to this random person by the looks of it. Did I talk to this person who... Oh, that's very snappy. Can I... Where did you get your suit? I want one. Chad. <laughs> Hi, friend. This guy's clearly having a good time. Just a few more drinks, and I'll have the courage to go talk to one of those pool beds. Do you even have a swimsuit? No oh, crap, bro. Do, do you have one I can borrow? Not that I lend you if I did. It's my opinion that most girls tend not to go for guys that borrow items from strangers that have had their crotches on them. Alright, I guess he agrees. Uh, okay, drinky time. Hey, can I get a... Screw it. A margarita and a tequila shot. Oh, Ooh, it's going to be a good slash bad night. You got it. I'm not... I'm, do you know what? It's not that I'm not a cocktail person. It's just that they're goddamn expensive. So it's like, as a, as a treat now and again? Yeah, but very rare. But I do like a good cocktail, it's just, you know, they go down too fast and you spend like all your bloody money and okay, I don't want to self-gripe it because I am going to really age myself, aren't I? I? Yeah, I'm down with the kids and drink cocktails and stuff like that and slamming tequilas. My green is a tequila shot. Enjoy. I will.
that's definitely warm on the chest. Ah, now I'll just have my margarita run by the tree near the house. Seems like a nice spot to sit and have a drink or five. Wait, where, which tree? Oh, here. Ah, well, I guess the music isn't bad. But I'll be damned if I'm reduced to engaging in continuous party banter. I'm hopeless. Drinks are good, though. Oh, crap. I think that guy's heading my way. You've got to find a way out. Fast. Avoid social situation. Despite the fact that I just talk to everybody anyway. Fake a seizure, you idiot! Please stop walking in this direction. You, stop giving me stupid advice. That's going to drag more attention to myself. Seizures. You still have a few more seconds. Oh God, who is this? Hey man. Oh God, please don't say something about how cool this party is. Cool party, huh? Oh. He said it. Yeah, pretty cool. That's it. Let's just go full statue. What kind of world are we living in when a man can't go to a party and just ignore everyone? Let's take a stand against forced party conversation. I know my rights! I'm totally allowed to sit on my own and drink. There's nothing weird about it. Name's Derek. I actually know Saw from back in high school. Well, we played the same frat. Fascinating. I... can't do it. Pathetic. Sorry, but am I supposed to know who this soul guy is? Or oh, we were meant to just ignore the conversation. Damn it, we're just leading him on. I would hope so. This is his party. Don't you know Saul? Um... Nah, let's be honest. I'm gonna stick with honesty is the best policy. You know, my friend made me come to this party. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Totally hate it when my friends invite me to open bars. Worst experience ever. Don't you stop coming at me with your sarcasm and bloody passive aggressivism. Next level sarcastic humour on this guy here. So where's your friend? She isn't here yet. Shouldn't be here soon. Don't accuse me of being a gay crasher. Oh, I see. Well, any friend of Souls is a friend of mine. Not a friend of Souls, though. Did this guy just become my friend without my permission? <clears throat> What's that? Stop talking to yourself in public. It's social interaction 101. I can't help myself. It's the only way of having a decent conversation. Talking to myself is the only way I'm getting any kind of discussion that I enjoy. Hmm, well in any case, hopefully you don't have to wait for it too long. Yeah, please. Otherwise I'll be asking you to drown me in the punch ball. This is one thing me and you both can agree on, Derek. I'm gonna go make some more rotations. Maybe I'll see you around. You don't have to make rotations. Go get yourself a comfortable seat and sit down and shut up. That act like it's my party. Tell people what to do now. Ugh. Huh? You survived social interaction. Reward yourself with a drink. Oh, yeah, I'm down with that. Want tequila shot and a margarita, please? Yeah, why mess with the classics, I guess. You got it. I drank that way too quick. Well, like less than five minutes. Well, again, margaritas probably isn't. I'm not a big fan of margaritas, actually. Here you go. Enjoy. Thanks, man. Should I tip you? Nah, man, you're good. Yeah, but are you just saying that? To not be awkward, or should I be? Actually, I should find a new place I might drink. No way I'm drunk enough for awkward small talk in the sequel. The talking. Find somewhere quiet to have your next drink. Alright. Where would that be? Behind the house? Can't get behind the house. Damn it. Where can I where where? There's no other quiet places besides the tree. Uh I guess I'll know when I get there because it'll just Oh all the way back here? No. Damn it! 
Should I go in the house? No. She's not talking yet. Paranoid people who don't talk. Where, where can I, where? Where does it want me to go? Oh, all the way outside. Okay, cool. I'm actually, oh, I'm already starting to feel this. This time I actually be tolerable by the end of this cup. Oh my God. I should call back. It's been at least five minutes. Call back. Okay, cool. Well, I'm not doing that yet. I'm gonna do that next time. Um, it's so good to be back in the world of Don't Give Up. Uh, I I forgot how much I was in, I was enjoying the style and the humor and the related goddamn ability. Man, the whole social awkwardness, the kind of trying to achieve things and not quite making it and all that kind of stuff and um, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big fan I'm a big fan of this game for sure uh, if you all want to go and try give it a try yourselves I'll pop a link to the game in the description below um, I really recommend it so for the, the value I've got of it so far it's been just astoundingly fun and uh, like the devs such a nice person like just, just, just genuine just genuine awesomeness going on here so yeah go give it a whirl if you want to give it a whirl and if you've got any game suggestions as to what my way uh work with the comments below or tweet me facebook me email me standard standard communication for um and that's it though i'm going to check out for now i've been mikey bly i hope you all have yourselves a fantastic morning afternoon evening or night regardless of if you're a party or not and i'll see you all Next time around. Bye for now.